545 is your time and it stood tall in the heart of Austin for 50 years, but soon it'll come down. The University Medical Center Brackenridge Tower is part of the former hospital. And before it's torn down, the community will have the chance today to say goodbye. Kaylin Norwood joins us now. Kaylin, a lot of history in this building and hospital. Right, Yvonne, there sure is. That tower has served thousands of patients, doctors, and nurses over the years. And today, some of them will share their memories of the hospital before it's demolished this summer to make room for some new development. And we're talking years of history. The nine-story tower has been sitting along I-35 and 15th Street for about 50 years. And Brackenridge Hospital itself has been there since 1884. Now, that's more than 100 years. So this tower has been a landmark for the hospital care in Austin and Travis. County. The hospital closed in 2017 and services were moved to Del Seton across the street. In addition to staff and patients, Mayor Steve Adler, the University of Texas president, along with the president of Central Health, will come together later this morning to help commemorate the hospital. Central Health wants to make sure that before that process starts, we have a chance to honor the people that worked at the hospital, the people who were served there, perhaps were born there. Um, you know, hospitals play such a vital role in the community, and University Medical Center Brackenridge certainly was no different than that. This level one trauma center used to be a safety net for those who didn't have health insurance. Now the 14 acre property will be used to help pay for health care for those in Travis County who are low income. Now, Central Health is already making millions off this property towards that cause. And coming up at 630, I'll talk about what's going to become of this space once the tower is officially torn down. In studio, Kayla Norwood, KB News.